XDS is a standout in Cadillac's current lineup. It's a throwback to the automaker's cars of the 90s and early 2000s. It's big, comfy and packs a punch under the hood, but there's only a slight pretense of sportiness, despite the V-Sport moniker. If you want a Cadillac that handles, buy a CTS or a TS. Still, there's nothing wrong with being a big, slightly soft cruiser. Not everyone is out to conquer the Nürburgring. Some people just want comfy seats and a half mile of wheelbase. Our tester is the range topping Platinum V Sport trim. At $73,040, it's not exactly cheap. That said, you do get a hell of a lot for your money. This car has heated and cooled massaging front seats with 22 way power adjustment, a heated steering wheel, heads up display, the latest version of Cadillac's infotainment system, Bose surround sound, LED headlights, and adaptive cruise control. That's not including all the V-Sport goodies like Brembo brakes, magnetic right and a howling 3.6-liter twin-turbo V6. Hopping in the Cadillac XTS, the familiar surroundings created a certain set of expectations. Like judging a book by its cover, it's an easy trap to judge a Cadillac by its interior, they all feel the same to me. Some of what I expected, I got, a smooth ride, hearty pep, robust driver assist and fussy audio and VAC controls. What surprised me was just how urgent this motor is. On paper, that should come as no surprise. The V Sports 3.6 liter twin turbo V6, making 410 horsepower and 369 pound feet of torque, is bound to pack a punch. You almost forget what that should feel like, though, until you put your right foot down. There's no lag, and despite the all wheel drive, there's even a little torque steer. The lightness of the steering means it's no difficult task to account for it, though. Speaking of steering, I actually enjoyed bending this through tight corners. It's a breeze to saw the tiller back and forth, and the car communicates the interaction between the tires, especially up front, with the road. I'd like to take this caddy to the track.